Alright guys, what's going on? So, we got another unboxing here. If you guys remember, uh, about a couple months ago we did the Heroes of the Grid unboxing where we unboxed all of that fun stuff. Now, as a recording of this, the Kickstarter of the new Zeo set just ended. So, hopefully you guys uh, back that if you guys uh, wanted to. If you haven't backed that, most of it, except for one item, was uh, retail, so it will be available in retail. Uh, the Gold Ranger from that Kickstarter was the only one that was uh, Kickstarter exclusive. But we do got another exclusive. All right, this was the Gen Con exclusive. Now, now I didn't go to Gen Con uh, this year. Uh, maybe one year I'll, I'll be able to uh, go there. But the way how I got this was Renegade was so awesome. What they did was you can order this from their site and you can still order this uh, from their site so it it was ex it was a con exclusive now it is a uh, their website exclusive so, uh, which is actually really cool and if you did back the second uh, Kickstarter you actually have a chance to add this uh, pack also there it would be the same price but uh, we're also gonna we're gonna unbox this this is the bulk and skull uh, character pack. Uh, so, this never happened in, in the TV show. This actually happened in the annual, in the first annual uh, Power Dress comic from Boom Comics. Uh, they had this little tongue-in-cheek uh, short story where uh, the other Rangers, uh, um, like, uh, weren't available, and so Zordon had to recruit Bulk and Skull, and they became like their own Rangers. It was very comedic like the drawings was completely different from all the other issues it was actually a uh, really fun uh, I think it was like four or five pages it was a really fun four or five pages uh, there so let without further ado let's go ahead and open it up these two they became the purple and orange Rangers and even here in the back in the back says behold the purple and orange Rangers um, and then obviously, you know, it requires Heroes of the Grid to play. Obviously, this is like way too small for you to play anything by itself. But let's go ahead and open it up uh, over here. It's cool. We have like Bulk over here in his Ranger suit. And we have a little funny uh, drawing of him right there. And then over here, same thing with Skull. We have him in his uh, Orange Ranger uh, costume. And then just another uh, funny drawing. And I actually really like the drawings they uh, that they chose with them. It really fits with their characters. So let's go ahead see what's inside here oh uh, all right <clears throat> we got like the the renegade like you know advertisement booklet like so you can see here all the other stuff not just power rangers like actually most of it's not power Rangers. Uh, but like you can see what uh renegade uh makes and then we got over here uh an advertisement uh for the retail exclusives we saw this in other uh, in the other uh, boxes as well yeah, uh, so and right here we got bulk as the purple ranger and we got skull as the orange ranger so let's go ahead and of course we got uh, of course we got cars to go with them too uh, the funny thing is like the so their uh, character and Zord cards uh, they were like actually on the bottom like so you, you can't actually like fit these here um, now you know there is room here that we can put some dice in here I'm just saying if like you know if they ever uh, make a purple and orange dice that would be awesome so here's a skull uh, as the orange ranger he has like that he has that like crazy like papadou a uh, haircut uh, like on his helmet and then he has the classic scarf that uh, skull wear wore like when he like in the first like uh, season of the series and so uh, like and that's actually what's actually really cool over here um you can barely like uh, it's gonna look better when, once we paint it but over here uh, we see that his like pants is like falling off it's like like and we see like a glimpse of his like underwear and like over here his shirt is kind of like untucked it is like so uh, messy really fits uh, with his uh, character over here and then over here we have uh, bulk as the 
Purple Ranger. Uh, back here we have his uh, we have his uh, ponytail, um, and then he has a uh, this uh, mohawk uh, going over over here, uh, and then uh, I can't uh, we'll know what Zord it is, but it, it looks like a pig. I'm, I can't remember if their Zords were based off of dinosaurs or just random uh, things. And so over here we have a uh, bulk, and his like gut is like bulging out of uh, his suit. Uh, which is actually pretty funny. Uh, so, really cool original designs. Um, now, me personally, like as much as I, I like the comics, I would have loved it more if it was the actual Incredible Bulkster and Super Skull. That would have been an awesome like uh, two character pack, and that actually came from uh, the show. They were they were like disguised as that like for a few episodes, um, but. Obviously, to fit more with the Ranger theme, you know, we got to have them as Rangers. But, let's go ahead and look at their cards. Here we go. These are going to be their character cards and their Zord cards. Because, you know, they're characters and they have their own Zords. Uh, Falkus Bar Bulk Bulkmeyer, uh, you know, over here. Uh, what's funny is that his card, like his shirt, actually uh, covers up um, uh, uh, himself. It doesn't actually... Uh, his gut's not sticking out here. And... But over here we have uh, Eugene Skull, uh, Skullovich, uh, and uh, we see that his clothes is still like uh, unkept over here, like not, not uh, clean. Uh, and then uh, like uh, Bulk's, Bulk's powers, Big Bully, and Skull, Skull's powers, uh, Wingman, really fits these characters a lot. Bulk's Zord is. Bacon Don, which is awesome. Like, so it is like, so it's like this warthog. It kind of looks like Pumbaa. Um, and, like, you know, just, uh, you know, kind of dinosaur ish. You know, you can, like, kind of trace this back to the Jurassic period, I guess. Um, but, like, you know, just, I just like his Bacon Don. Uh, like, you know, fits with a uh, uh, bulk over there with his um, obesity. And then. <laughs> Uh, skulls is feather dactyl and it's like a little chicken because like uh, you know like skull is always like you know kind of like chickenish uh that's actually really cool uh you know still you can kind of like you know they're stretching dinosaurs just a little bit but uh really fits their both their characters a lot and over here we have their their decks so let's go ahead and open it up we got uh, bulk over here. <laughs> oh, that's funny. We got a cockroach combo uh, card. Uh, fighting dirt. Uh, <laughs> fight dirty, which is cool. Uh, so, so some really uh, fun cards. Some really fun art uh, to go with him. And uh, like over here, we see that the gut is actually sticking out just like his figure, which is great. Uh, re really like really like this uh you know uh i would have just liked at least one of them to reference like you know the incredible bulkster or something like that we got we got skull over here skull also has cockroach combo which is good because you know the card actually has both of them smashing in maybe this is like kind of like their uh blade blaster card because like from the base game like and also the hyperforce rangers they all had like one card that they all shared so maybe this is their shared card and that like what i like is that if it is the shared like since it is a shared card it actually has both of them on here unlike the other cards like especially like the blade blaster and the uh especially the hyperforce uh, i forget what the hyperforce blaster was i think that was also blade blaster but what i didn't like about that card was that it just showed the the red ranger and so it was so confusing for me because i thought there was a misprint um we got chase the shot <laughs> Fight or flight over here. He's carrying bulk. That's hilarious. And look, <laughs> uh, power nap. Oh, cool. So power nap actually has like their uh their their civilian faces. Like I don't think any of bulk's cars had their civilian faces. So that's actually pretty cool. Uh, <laughs> high five strike. So <laughs> I like this one. This is a I like this card. Uh, finger guns. So really cool art. Uh, really like that the art is very playful, uh, matches their characters. Uh, like, so I really like the art on all the cards. It really is playful 
and really matches their characters a lot, which I really like. The characters look really fun uh, to play as. I can't wait to uh, try them out. Uh, let me know down in the comments below what you guys think about this character pack. Let me know if you uh, ordered it, if you uh if it's coming your way right now or if you are uh waiting to or if you're uh ordering it with the kickstarter pack and you're gonna wait for that um uh just let me know um and uh let me know if you guys actually played the game we played the game a couple of times we're having lots of fun with it uh so we actually found a local group of people who are also interested in the game and who's either uh purchased the game or ha or hasn't uh, purchased it yet uh we actually uh, try to meet up regularly and play together it's been lots of fun and it's really great to meet like other people like with a common interest it's been fun uh let me know if you guys had a chance to you know uh do it in, in local groups uh or not um if you haven't i really recommend uh you do it uh it's like you know especially with strangers it's really fun to play with people that way you get to know uh new people let me know down in the comments below what you think about this pack and let me know um you know do you prefer them to see to be them as uh rangers or do you prefer them to be like you know from the tv show when they're dressed up as like their own like goofy superheroes uh, i want i'm curious about that too all right guys till next time see ya